Hi everybody, good morning, it's Lisa. Today is Friday, August the 25th, 2017, and it is my week 26 do, post duodenal switch update. Um, how is everybody? I've had a weird week. Um, I'll start with my stats. Um, so my highest recorded weight was 344.6 back on January 2nd, 2017. And my state of surgery weight, um, which was February 24th, 2017, was 308.8. Last week, I came to you at 213.8. And today, I weighed in at 210.6. So it's a 3.2 pound loss for the week. Uh, 134 since I started in January and 98.2 since surgery. Um, so stats are great. Um, oh, quick update. I did go to my six month um, doctor's visit and once again, I didn't get to see my doctor. Big shock. I saw the PA again. Of course he had emergency surgery. What can you do? There's nothing you can do. He's a busy guy. And the PA actually said to me, I probably get to spend a little more time with her than I would with him uh, if he had seen me. Whatever. So, um, but my lab results were in and things are really good. So I was really pleased with that. Uh, the only thing that is still low is my vitamin A and um, it was actually 0.1 <laughs> higher than it was uh, last time uh, we checked it. So I'm going to stay with my vitamin D increased dosage uh, that I did from the last blood work because that went up and that is at a good range. So I'm gonna keep taking that uh, extra supplement. And for the vitamin A, we've now increased it to a second sublingual a day. So I'm gonna take one in the morning and one at night. And they're each 10,000 IU. So it's an extra 20,000 um, that I'm getting daily and hopefully that'll boost me. But I'm still just on the very cusp of the low range. So uh, not anything to be too concerned about. My potassium, I don't know if you remember, but last time my potassium was uh, just under the low by like 0.1 and it's exactly the same so they don't they're not concerned about that at all and everything else looks good uh, in fact my protein uh, counts went up my iron uh, stayed pretty much stable so yeah so everything's good on the vitamin front and um, she was checking my um, like my skin and we were documenting some of that for later down the road. Uh, what I mean by that is, for the most part, my skin is doing okay, uh, the hanging skin that's happening, but uh, I was having some little issues with little areas of breakdown, and so we, note, we noted that, and she said that's important to kind of note that kind of stuff. However, um, so, I don't even know how to explain this, but like, so she was checking like around my belly button and she pulled the skin, not, you know, this way, but this way to kind of look in between the skin folds that are there and she ripped my skin. Yeah, seriously, ripped my skin. She pulled it so hard that it ripped. I felt it happen and I didn't say anything and I was like, oh my God, she ripped my skin. I've been so careful to make sure it hasn't ripped, but yeah. So I had that to deal with this past week. That was fun, but it's healed now. And um, it's been a pretty good week overall. I just kind of feel a little meh, okay? Uh, other than that, like, I, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, I, I know I had my time of the month, which is oh so joyful. And so I know that attributed to a lot of it. I just did not have super big energy when it came to exercise. Uh, I wasn't in the pool that much. Um, I think maybe twice this past week, which is not usual for me. Um, still walking, but I did start doing like stomach 
um, stomach crunch exercises, um, things like that. And I was really kind of doing a little bit more of the weight, like weight training type stuff. But I just, gosh, I just kind of feel blah about the week. Um, food is not very interesting to me. I'm wondering if maybe I'm getting bored with food choices. Like it seems to be the same thing all the time. And so I think that's kind of affecting me. Like I need to try to branch out. It's just I, consistency of food is a big thing with me. And so I struggle a lot of times with how food feels in my mouth. I know that's weird, but um, it is what it is. And so, yeah, I'm just kind of not not feeling it right now. But, you know, I'm sure I will kind of get out of this little funk. I'm feeling a little bit better today, feeling like I have a little more energy, like I want to get out and do things. So that's a good thing. Um, but if anybody has any suggestions for some uh, recipes that I could try, I, and I will put this out there, I am still not a seafood fan. I have, I was hoping that my tastes would change when it came to that, but not really. So seafood is not, uh, unfortunately, not something that I like. And I mean, I do like a little bit, like I like shrimp, but I can only eat so many shrimp and then I'm done. So yeah, if you have any recipes or any ideas um, for easy meals that I could try, I would really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, other than that, you know, good week. I'm really happy with my loss. Um, hoping that I can increase my exercise and happy that my labs came back great. For me, the labs, you know, that makes me nervous um, before I go. And so I was really happy that those were good. So I hope you all have a great week. Not a lot going on my end, uh, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.